Fits. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen. I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW Blue Plan. But today, we are not talking WW, we're talking Christmas. I have a huge Christmas decor and tree decorating haul for you. On my Instagram, I posted a poll and asked you if I should revamp, redo, redecorate this year's Christmas tree, and you guys unanimously voted yes, which basically means that I am stripping my tree down to the bare limbs, and I have changed the theme, and I have purchased all brand new ornaments and a tree topper to completely change everything about my Christmas tree and I can't wait. And I also am going to share with you guys some home decor that I picked up. Everything is from Hobby Lobby, Target, and then one fun thing that I picked up at my local Raw Stress for Less store. So I can't wait. It is going to be a huge, massive haul, and wait until you see all of the Christmas goodies that I picked up. If you're new to my channel, make sure that you're subscribed and that your bell is turned on so you don't miss a single video. This is the first of many Christmas-themed videos coming your way this holiday season. I am going to do a home tour once all my Christmas decorations are up. We'll do Bake With Me's for Christmas. There's just a lot coming, so make sure you're subscribed. If you're excited about a big Christmas decor haul, give this video a big thumbs up and make sure you're checking out that description box down below where you're going to find my nutrition coaching website. I can help coach you along your healthy lifestyle, links and discount codes to my favorite things, as well as the link to come over and join us on Facebook. We would love to have you. So without further ado, I'm so excited. Let's jump into this year's Christmas haul. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. So first I'm gonna start with home decor because I want to kind of segue into the tree because that's the majority of what I picked up. So the first thing that I grabbed for this year is this cute little pluggable fragrance warmer that is this adorable little snowman. Now this is the one thing that I actually picked up from Ross. So I just think he's so cute and he's going to go in my living room. I have some plugins in there right now that are just basic decor. So I wanted to have one that would plug in in place of that. And this was $5.99 at Ross. So you can't beat that price. From the Target dollar spot, I picked up this cute little Merry Christmas sign. Now I showed this to you guys in a grocery haul, but in case you missed it, this was in the Target dollar spot for $5. And I just think it's so cute. It's kind of got that rustic vibe to it. Looks like shiplap. They had ones that say be merry and fall a lot as well, but I loved the red Mike Merry Christmas. Also from the Target dollar spot, I grabbed this cute little tree. He's so pretty and glittery and silver. And I just think that it's going to look really nice with kind of this rustic feel that I'm going with this year. And you can see that the base is this nice solid wood. And this was $3 in the Target dollar spot. You could zhuzh this up with other Christmas decor. I just, I thought that the silver with the glitter on it that looks like fallen snow was beautiful. So from Hobby Lobby, I selected this cute little snowman with with legs that are on strings. I just think he's so cute. He definitely has that rustic feel to him as well. This was $7.99 and half off. So all of the Christmas stuff was half off at Hobby Lobby. So this was only $4 and his little hat moves like a bobblehead. I just thought he was so cute. And I thought that you could put him on a shelf even with the tree and that would just be a super cute addition to your Christmas decor. I went ahead and picked up some Christmas packaging slash gift bags and things to wrap gifts with. The the first thing is this five count pack of Christmas bags. They all have the same pattern of the red polka dots. This was $6.99 half off. So basically $3.50. And I use these for real estate when I give gifts to my clients. And I just thought that they would be really cute for Christmas for any gift that was just kind of in a regular shape or hard to wrap. This would be a great idea to put it in. And you can't beat about 50 cents a gift bag. If you're part of my Facebook group, you know that we are doing our second annual Christmas card exchange, which is such a wonderful, part of the holidays. Basically, we send cards out and when you receive a card, you send one in return and we just fill our mailboxes with love and Christmas cards, which is so awesome. I was so excited last Christmas to be able to go to my PO box every day and check and see what Christmas cards had arrived. So we are doing that again this year and I needed some more cards. I did pick up some last year after the holidays, but I don't think I have enough. I literally had over a hundred cards in my mailbox over the course of the holidays last year. So I want to be 
stocked up and ready to go on my cards. So I found these really cute ones at Hobby Lobby. They say Merry Christmas and they have leopard and buffalo check and striped Christmas trees. I just think that they're very cute. They're very rustic. These were $14.99 and again, they were half off and there's 20 cards in envelopes. So $7 or $7.50 for 20 cards is not bad. And I just think that these are so cute. On the inside, these particular cards say, may the beauty of this season bring you peace and deepest joy. And I just love it. And who doesn't need a little peace at the end of 2020? At Hobby Lobby, I picked up this Christmas party tissue 40 count pack. Look at all those fun, exciting colors of Christmas. This was $4.99 and half off, so $2.50. And again, I wanted to have filler for gift bags and to wrap clothing and breakable things when we go to wrap those up for presents this year. You can't beat Hobby Lobby for all this decor and wrapping items because they're all half off. I needed some more gift tags, so I loved these Buffalo Check Merry Christmas. These were $2.99, half off, $1.50 can't beat that and there are 12 gift tags in here i did buy some of these packs last christmas so i still have some but i wanted to make sure that i didn't run out of gift tags and again i like to even attach these when i'm putting together a gift bag for a client or for a gift i needed something to seal all those christmas cards so i found these really cute envelope sealers that say merry christmas they were 2.99 and half off there's 36 in here so they would seal 36 cards. And I do believe that I have one package of these left over from last year. So I should have enough cute little stickers to seal all my Christmas cards. I'm seriously so excited for Christmas cards. We have Christmas Eve and Christmas Day at our house. We do have the largest house in our family. So on Christmas Eve, it's generally my husband and I, my mom and her boyfriend, and then my cousin, his wife, and their adult children come over. And when they leave, along with my mom, I like to send a lot of the leftover Christmas goodies and things that I I just don't need it in my house because I'll eat them away. So at Hobby Lobby, I found this really pretty tin that says Merry Christmas. It's quite large. And I thought that I could send this with my cousin and his wife with some of the leftover Christmas goodies. I could send this home with them. So this was $5 and 59 cents and half off of that. So you can't beat it. And it is a big tin, which means I can send home a lot of goodies. At Hobby Lobby, I fell in love with this gorgeous, tree i just think that it is stunning with the berries and the greenery and the snow and the glitter and it goes with this whole theme for my tree which you will see shortly but i had to pick this up at hobby lobby because i thought it was beautiful and i have the perfect spot in my living room for it 24.99 half off so about 13 dollars. you couldn't pass it up also at hobby lobby I picked up this garland. So on the bottom of the sofa table in my living room, I like to put garland in lights. I do it for fall, Halloween. You saw that in my fall home tour, in my Halloween home tour. So I have to do that for Christmas as well. I think this garland is absolutely beautiful and I'm going to string some white lights through it. So I'll show those to you. These are from, this garland is from Hobby Lobby. It was $59.99 and half off, which I don't think is bad at all because this garland is stunning and it's long it's definitely going to fill that space under my table in my formal living room and these are the white lights that i picked up at hobby lobby for the garland these were 30 percent off 5.99 normal price so three or four dollars which is not bad a hundred lights should be more than enough to kind of inter tangle into the garland and put it on that table so now let's get into what i have for my tree this year so in past years if you remember from last year when i showed my tree we kind of had a hodgepodge of decorations every year we travel to leavenworth washington for our anniversary slash our birthdays and we always pick a family ornament out something that we can personalize with my name troy's name and our two dogs and so that those ornaments always go up on the tree of course and then we just kind of have a mismatch of other ornaments in the town that i live in we have an old world christmas outlet so we're able to go buy old world christmas ornaments for a killer price like three to four to five dollars an ornament when these sell everywhere for 15 to 20 dollars a piece so i did go to that outlet about six years ago and bought a few big packs of mismatched kind of old world christmas style ornaments and i'm just kind of over it 
to be honest. We've had those same ornaments on our tree now for a few years. I did buy a new tree skirt last year, but I'm just ready to change it up. And I'm really loving this rustic Christmas feel. Like my tree and my garland, I'm loving that green and that red and those traditional colors of Christmas, but paired with a really rustic feel. So I decided this year that I was again, stripping the tree down to the bare limb and completely redoing the ornaments with the exception of our family ornaments. Those will continue to stay on the tree. They're just really special to us. We've had them for almost six years since my husband and I met. And of course we have Diesel and Lola and they have ornaments as well. So those ornaments will still go up on the tree. But other than that, the old world Christmas is going away. The classic round, red, silver, gold ornaments, they're going away as well. And we are going rustic. And I can't wait to show you what I picked up this year to redo my Christmas tree. There's so much, there's seriously so much. So first I'm going to show you all of the ornaments that I decided to purchase because that way you get the feel for the theme. I did buy some bell type ornaments that'll go on the tree as well and some sticks, like some picks as well as a new tree topper. So first let me show you all of the ornaments and when I say there's a lot, there's a lot. So this is the style that I'm going with, these kind of earthy woodsy tones with the deep green and the beautiful red and this whole rustic moose outdoor vibe. So that's what I'm going for. So ornament number one is absolutely adorable. All of my ornaments are from Hobby Lobby. This particular ornament was $3.99 before half off. So everything was half off. So this ornament was $2. I just thought it was super cute. And of course I had to get something with some Buffalo check and this was right up my alley. You can see kind of the theme that I'm going for as we pull out all of these ornaments. This one was also $3.99. I fell in love with this moose. I also have a bear, a black bear as well. I love the wreath around his neck with the berries and the glittery snow. It goes very, very well with the garland. I love this. This one was $5 before any discounts. You can't beat the price at Hobby Lobby. These ornaments elsewhere would be $15 a piece, 10 to $15. And the fact that I paid $2.50 for this just blows my mind. I love this. So let me show you the bear that goes with the moose. So here's the bear. Isn't he the cutest? He was also $2.50. And you can see these two just go really nicely together total rustic Christmas. They have these beautiful wooden snowflakes with the greenery in the middle. There was a couple of different styles. I did pick up one of each of those. These were only $2 a piece after the discount and I think that they are stunning. And here's the second one. It just has the pine cones with the greenery in the middle. I just think that these are absolutely beautiful and they just really tie in that whole rustic vibe. I decided to get two of these because I loved it so much. These were $2.50. Again, they're that rustic metal moose with the greenery kind of wreath and pine cones around their neck. I really liked these and I thought that we could have two of these kind of spaced out on the tree. This was one of the first ornaments that I saw at Hobby Lobby, which in inspired me to go with this whole rustic theme for Christmas. I loved this. I thought this was so cute. Again, the whole burlap kind of string around the star. Loved this one. This one was $4.99, so $2.50. I loved this Noel star with the bell and the little jute string. It is kind of a soft material, a felt. It's so cute, and I love the stitching. It's very, very homespun, home Christmas, which I love. $3.99, so I paid $2 for this. A second buffalo check ornament that goes with that moose. This is just a beautiful snowflake. I really tried to pick ornaments that had this same greenery, the wreath, the pine cone, the snowy tree limb kind of look to it so that they would all mesh really well on the tree. And wait until you see the picks and the tree topper and it'll all kind of come together. Both of these I thought were absolutely adorable. One that says Merry Christmas and one that says Joy to the World. If you didn't know, my middle name is Joy. So anytime I can find something that says Joy for Christmas, I always like to pick it up. These were $3.99, so I paid $2 a piece. I love that they're a little bit different, but they still are definitely rustic. This little tree goes nicely with the star with the tree in the middle, same kind of aesthetic with the little min miniature one hanging in the middle with the jute. So these two are kind of matchy matchy which I love. I immediately fell in love with these. It is actually three different ones that are the same kind of look to them. They are just an ornament. They're metal. They have a cute plaid ribbon and some burlap. So there is the red kind of round ornament. There is the green 
Looks like a carrot ornament with the same burlap and plaid ribbon. And then this oblong kind of green shaped ornament, again with the ribbon, these were $3.99 a piece. So I only paid $2. And I love that there's the red, there's the cream, there's the green. They're all this really pretty matching set. I absolutely loved these. These were one of the other first ones that I saw, this cute little wooden Santa and wooden snowman. These were only $1.50 a piece with the discount. And I just thought they were so, so cute. Same color scheme with the greens and the reds and the burlap and those natural colors. I just couldn't pass these up. I thought these were adorable. And can you believe both of these were $3? I love this little lantern with these berries and the twigs. There was only one of them. I would have bought several of these because I think these would have, I think this would look really cute with several sporadic on the tree, but I did pick up the last one that they had. Someone else must have had the same idea. This was $2 after the discount. Like I said, anything with the word joy on it, I have to have. I loved this little wooden tree. I wish that they would have had more of these with different sayings because I definitely would have grabbed more, but I just think this is so cute with the multicolored stacked tree and of course joy in the middle. This was $2 after the discount. And last but not least for ornaments is this super cute sleigh. Now I almost didn't get this. I picked it up and put it back about four times because it's heavy. And I was just afraid that it would be hard to put up on the tree, that it would just really kind of weight the tree down. But I had to have it. It is so cute. It has the sleigh is metal with the cute little wood and the greenery and the berries. I loved it. And it was $4.99, so I paid $2.50. Also, I think these would be really cute just as decor pieces on a mantle or on a tear tray in your kitchen or just incorporated with other Christmas decor. I had to have it. I really hope that it's not too heavy for the tree, but like I said, if it is, we can just use it as Christmas decor. So that was all for ornaments. I did wanna show you the picks that I picked up. So I went ahead and selected eight of these. These have pine cones, snowy greenery, some holly leaves. I just love them. I think that they really tie together the theme that I'm going for, kind of that outdoor rustic look of my Christmas tree. And just look, you put all of these together, I, I'm obsessed. So I have eight of these. I'm just going to stick them randomly in my tree. Now, last year at Hobby Lobby, I did pick up some other picks that had some red holly berries and I think some gold ribbon. I may use those as well. I just wanna see how that ties together. These were a dollar a piece. So I have eight of them for $8. I really like adding these picks and some of these different decor pieces to the tree as well. So I am excited to see how these incorporate. And like I mentioned, I decided to throw away all the old school Christmas bulbs, the reds, the greens, the golds, and I'm not going to add those to my tree this year, but I saw these and these are actually little metal bells. They're red, brown, and green. They have some greenery and some holly berries on top. You can hear them. Jingle, these were $15.99 for all three of these. And then of course they were half off. So I ended up picking up three packages and I'm going to use these in place of Christmas bulbs on my tree. Just to still kind of go with the rustic theme and take away just the old school bulbs. Like I said, I'm kind of over all of that. So I have three packs of these. And last but not least for this year's tree is the tree topper. What tree doesn't have a tree topper? So I saw this and immediately fell in love. I actually saw this before I ever went over to the ornament section. So I was able to, again, think of my theme and really incorporate the ornaments I selected with my tree topper. I just think this is stunningly beautiful. It has the pine cones and the greenery. It was $14.99 and half off. I paid $7.50 for this and I literally love this and I can't wait to see how this entire tree comes together. I almost forgot two more things that I picked up. I have so much Christmas stuff surrounding me that I missed two things. I picked these up at Hobby Lobby and again, I just loved them. They go with the whole rustic decor and I'm just going to incorporate these onto my table in my formal living room or somewhere within my house that's rustic feel for Christmas. So I picked up the large present and the small present, you guys, aren't they so cute? I had to have them. I just think that side by side, these are absolutely adorable. This one was $11.99, half off, $9.99, half off. How cute. So that's everything for my massive 
2020 Christmas decor haul. I can't wait to share my tree with you. Of course, I'll be doing a home tour. Stay tuned for lots and lots of Christmas content coming your way. Let me know down in the comments, what do you guys think of what I picked out? Do you think it's going to look good on the tree and I'll be able to tie in all the rest of the decor with my house? And also let me know down in the comments how excited you are for Christmas because it's coming up so quickly. I can't wait to get my house all decorated. And also, if you enjoyed today's video, please do me a big favor and give it a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel and lets me know that you do wanna see more Christmas related content coming down the road. If you're new again, subscribe. I'd love to have you. Turn the bell on next to it so you don't miss any videos. And of course, don't forget about that description box down below with my nutrition coaching website, links and discount codes to my favorite things, my Facebook group, and yeah, that's about it. Merry early Christmas, my friends. So I hope again you enjoyed today's Christmas decor haul. It was so much fun shopping for everything. I was able to get everything that I showed you today for under $200, which I think is a fantastic deal to completely redo a tree and add to my home decor. So I'm super excited. Merry early Christmas, my friends. I love you so much, and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye.